Hey, what's up? What's going on? It's KO, Mr. Cash Style. You already know, it's kind of woke. Um, you know, being in the space that I'm in, you know, uh, the music industry is like a seesaw, bro. You know, one day, one season it's good, one day, uh, you know, the next season it's a little shaky. Um, it's all about consistency. So uh, for me, I've always made sure that I put my best foot forward in terms of consistency and stuff like that. And being here uh, 13 years later where I can put out another album and people still get excited is extremely humbling. I mean, it's in the nature of any artist to be nervous before you release either a single or a full body of work, you know, because you don't know how it's gonna go down, you know. But um, I must say, when I pushed the button on Super Duper earlier this year, I knew what I had in my, um, in the back of my pocket. Same thing with this album. I went into it, you know, confident that I was gonna, you know, hit right, I was gonna hit the sweet, sweet spot. And um, I think, I guess what's happening right now, it's just like how people have received it, is testament to my gut feeling. I'm ecstatic. I managed to conjure up, you know, a solid body of work, early reviews, say that this is a classic. Um, I couldn't have, you know, um, asked for a better um, new reception. Um, I decided I was done <laughs> probably like two days before I submitted. And uh, it was just like final touches on uh, some of the songs that we were doing. I think the last song that we recorded was Flight School with Java. So it was me just putting final touches on that. And then um, I had to make sure as well with the mixing process that it was, you know, impeccable. So yeah, I think we, we did a great job.